Six dangerous side effects of turmeric and curcumin that most people don't know about. Turmeric and its active compound curcumin have long been hailed as natural miracle remedies for their impressive health benefits. From fighting inflammation and aiding digestion to supporting liver function and even showing potential in cancer prevention. In the world of medicine, curcumin has been studied at doses ranging from 500 milligrams to 2,000 milligrams per day. To boost its absorption, curcumin is often paired with piperine, a compound found in black pepper, which can increase its bioavailability by up to 20 times. However, what many people don't realize is that when used improperly, especially at high doses over a long period, or when combined with prescription medications, curcumin can also cause serious side effects that could harm your health. Welcome to Health Boost Recipes. Eat well, live healthy. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe so you never miss out on easy to understand practical health knowledge for you and your loved ones. Over the past two decades, serious medical research has shown that curcumin, the primary active ingredient in turmeric, supports overall health through well-documented biological mechanisms. One of its standout benefits is its ability to reduce inflammation and joint pain. Some clinical studies even suggest that, when taken in the right dosage and in a highly absorbable form, curcumin can be just as effective as ibuprofen for managing osteoarthritis and joint pain. Without the harmful effects on the stomach that are common with non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs. In addition, curcumin is a powerful antioxidant. It helps neutralize free radicals, the unstable molecules that damage cells and contribute to premature aging and chronic diseases. There's even evidence that curcumin may protect DNA from oxidative stress, potentially lowering the risk of developing conditions like cancer and cardiovascular disease. Curcumin also plays a role in modulating the immune system, helping to calm down chronic inflammation a major underlying factor in diseases such as inflammatory bowel conditions, systemic lupus, and allergic disorders. It's also been shown to support liver function and digestion by stimulating bile production, which improves fat digestion and reduces bloating and indigestion. What's even more exciting is that in lab and animal studies, curcumin has demonstrated potential to suppress the growth of abnormal cells. Opening the door to its possible use in cancer prevention, though more large-scale human trials are needed to confirm this effect. So if you're taking turmeric daily or thinking about adding curcumin to your wellness routine, this video will give you a clearer understanding and help you avoid common and potentially harmful mistakes. One, interferes with blood clotting. Multiple studies have shown that curcumin can inhibit platelet aggregation, one of the first steps in forming blood clots. This gives curcumin a mild blood thinning effect, which can increase the risk of bleeding, especially in people taking anticoagulant medications such as warfarin, aspirin, clopidogrel, or newer blood thinners like e.g. rivaroxaban, apixaban, etc. When curcumin is taken alongside these medications without medical supervision, it can significantly raise the risk of internal bleeding, prolonged bruising, nosebleeds, blood in urine, or even gastrointestinal hemorrhaging. What's more concerning is that many people take high-dose turmeric or curcumin supplements in capsule form without realizing these potential interactions. That's why anyone on blood thinners or with a history of clotting disorders should not take curcumin supplements without first consulting their doctor. In addition, if you're preparing for surgery, even a minor one, it's strongly recommended that you stop using curcumin at least 14 days before your procedure to reduce the risk of excessive bleeding during and after surgery. This is an important precaution that's often overlooked, especially when turmeric-based products are assumed to be harmless, natural supplements. Two, skin allergies. Turmeric and curcumin are often seen as gentle herbal remedies, but in reality, high doses or improper use can still trigger unwanted reactions, especially on the skin. The most common symptoms include itchiness, redness, rashes, and in some cases, contact dermatitis, a form of skin inflammation caused by exposure to allergens or irritants. 
These reactions tend to occur when turmeric or curcumin is used in high doses over time or when applied directly to the skin in the form of face masks, gels, or turmeric-infused oils. Even when the intention is to lighten the skin, fade scars, or reduce inflammation, sensitive skin may react strongly to concentrated turmeric extracts. This can lead to localized irritation, dryness, peeling, or even inflammation. In some cases, oral use of curcumin can still cause skin reactions in people who are naturally sensitive or allergic to it. 3. Digestive Issues while curcumin, the active compound in turmeric, is widely known for its digestive and liver-supporting benefits, many people actually experience digestive discomfort when they use it incorrectly. Common symptoms include bloating, gas, mild stomach pain, and acid reflux. These symptoms often lead people to believe they're simply not compatible with turmeric, when in reality, the issue usually lies in the dosage, timing, or formulation. One of the most common causes of these side effects is taking curcumin on an empty stomach or using turmeric extracts that don't include any fat-based component. It's important to understand that curcumin is fat-soluble, meaning it needs fat to be absorbed properly. When taken on its own or without food, especially a meal that includes healthy fats, absorption is poor and it can irritate the lining of the stomach. This explains why some people feel nauseous experience a burning sensation in the upper abdomen, or have a queasy stomach when they take turmeric or curcumin supplements early in the morning on an empty stomach. Four, significant drop in blood pressure. Although curcumin is praised for its anti-inflammatory, antioxidant, and cardiovascular benefits, it's not always safe for everyone, especially for individuals with blood pressure concerns. One of the lesser known but clinically important side effects of curcumin is its ability to lower blood pressure, particularly at high doses or when combined with antihypertensive medications. Research has shown that curcumin may help relax blood vessels, improve circulation, and reduce vascular resistance, all of which are beneficial for those with high blood pressure. However, when curcumin is taken alongside ACE inhibitors, beta blockers, or calcium channel blockers, it may enhance the blood pressure lowering effect of these medications, leading to hypotension or abnormally low blood pressure. Five, inhibits iron absorption. One lesser known but important effect of long-term curcumin use is its potential to inhibit iron absorption, especially non-heme iron, the type of iron primarily found in plant-based foods. Curcumin has a natural ability to bind with metal ions, including iron, which reduces the amount of iron that can be absorbed through the intestinal lining. While this might not pose an immediate problem for healthy individuals, high-dose or prolonged curcumin supplementation without proper guidance can gradually lower the body's iron stores, particularly in people who are already at risk of iron deficiency. At-risk groups include premenopausal women, strict vegetarians or vegans, children going through growth spurts, and individuals with a history of iron deficiency anemia. These groups often have higher iron requirements, and their dietary iron is more easily affected by absorption inhibitors like curcumin. Failing to recognize this connection can lead to microcytic anemia, persistent fatigue, poor concentration, and an overall decline in quality of life. Six may increase risk of kidney stones. Although turmeric and curcumin are widely used as natural remedies for inflammation, liver protection, and immune support, not everyone knows that taking high doses of traditional turmeric powder over an extended period can increase the risk of developing kidney stones, especially in those who are genetically predisposed or have a history of urinary stones. The reason? Natural turmeric powder contains a relatively high amount of oxalates, compounds that, when combined with calcium in the urine, can form calcium oxalate, the main component of most kidney stones. Curcumin stands out as one of the most powerful natural compounds for its anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties, offering a wide range of health benefits. But like any supplement, it's not without risks if used improperly. The key to safely integrating curcumin into your health routine is to understand its effects, stick to appropriate dosages, 
and consider your personal health conditions. When used wisely, curcumin can be a valuable part of a wellness-focused lifestyle, but shh, more is not always better.